We're given two boxes here. It says draw the wave function and probability density of a particle in a one-dimensional box with a length four nanometers at an n equals four state. So n equals four. Uh, and these there's two boxes given going from zero to L, where L, the length of the box is four nanometers. Okay? And then it wants us to draw the two functions. Okay, there's a number of things we want to do. In the first box, it wants us to draw the wave function. First, one way you can do that is you say, well, how many nodes are there? Does anybody remember from class today? How you find nodes? It's n minus 1, or 3, because there's n is 4. So that means, and this will draw the normal function right here, it's going to hit the axis three times at equal distant places. And so it's going to go up first and down through each of these nodes. Like that. Okay, so we kind of like a sine function. Is that okay so far? Yeah. Okay. And it goes through the three nodes. That's great. And we've drawn that. Uh, we didn't talk too much about, but my class will see soon, to draw the probability density. So this would be like psi of x here. The probability density means where we're likely to find the electron. And it's actually the picture on the left is squared. So we're going to square all this. If we square a positive number, what will we get in return? Just a bigger positive number. So this will go up, higher, and down. If you square zero, what do we get? Zero. So the nodes will continue to exist. Square a negative number, get a positive number of equal height. And uh, again positive, and again positive. Is that okay? What does this symbol mean? Like the what, what does what mean? The this? Yeah. That is the name, uh, just like in math, you might call something f of x equals x squared plus 3 or whatever. Mm -hmm. Well, instead of using the f, which we could have used here, but that's so negative, they use a psi. So psi just means a function that describes an electron. Okay. And it's just a variable, just like f of x, g of x, whatever. Is that okay? Yeah. So uh, this would be, say, some sine function. So psi of x would be some sine function. Uh, I don't know if you learned it in your class, but we learned that psi is the square root of 2 over L sine n pi x, or in this case, 4 pi x over L. So it would be this function. This would be psi of x. <coughs> Is that okay? Yeah. All right. Uh, so we've got both. If you square it, the wave function, you'll get what's called the probability density, or the probability distribution, or it has kind of analogous names like that. And that basically <coughs> tells you where you're going to find the, the particle. So the higher it is above here, the more likely you'll find the electron there. So for example, you're not going to find it in a node, zero probability, but you'll most likely find it at each of these peaks. That's where the electron will most likely be. Uh, let's see. What is the probability of finding particle range between zero and five? Uh, so I think it looks like he also wants the nodes. So if this is zero, this is L, this node would have to be half of L, okay? L over 2, which would probably end up being 2 nanometers. This would be L over 4, which would end up being 1 nanometer. This is 3L over 4, which would end up being 3 nanometers. Is that okay? Yeah. All right, uh, let's see what else they want. What's the energy? This is something I don't really do too much of in my class, but the energy uh, actually just has a mathematical formula if you need to calculate it. Uh, so I'll give that to you. Is n squared h squared over 
8ml squared. n is 4. h is Planck's constant. Is that okay? Mm -hmm. 8. m is the mass of the electron. Which you have to look up. It'd be 9.109 times 10 to the minus 31, I think. Wait. The mass of an electron. Oh, so you'd have to look up for the specific electron mass? Or? Uh, yeah, these are always going to be for electrons. Okay. Yeah, unless it's a really weird problem. So this would be the mass of an electron. Mm -hmm. And the length would be 4 nanometers, but you have to change that to meters. Mm 